Hello everyone, Jim here from Storm Warning News with some news concerning Israel. Certainly a situation we need to be watching as we step further into the end times and we are watching that entire part of the world. Senior officials to Israeli media, the special security assessment ended a little while ago, so that was a couple hours ago, extremely serious and urgent security issues that could affect the country in the next few days were discussed. It's impossible to detail more than that. That was tweeted by Endgame World War III. And then we're looking over here. There is a NOTAM in place, okay? A notice to airmen, if you are familiar with that, to basically clear the airspace. Tonight between 2200 at night and 5 o'clock in the morning, aircraft traffic in Netanya will switch to a northern mode. Landings from the north, quite routine, but usually the takeoffs will move north to a route over Netanya. What is the reason? I can't elaborate beyond that. Maybe in the morning. This was uh, tweeted by uh, Ite Blumenthal, who was a military correspondent uh, for Channel 11 News over there. So what exactly is taking place? Is there going to be a missile test or some other type of test? Or because of the security assessment that has ended, is there some other danger that they are sensing? And military chief Herzi Halavey said that amid the controversy in Israel over the government's judicial overhaul or potential judicial overhaul, this is being debated right now, my friends, the Israel Defense Forces have picked the side of protecting the country. In recent days, quite a few people have been telling me, choose which side of history you want to be on. They are, by the way, on both sides of the dispute, Halavi says at an award ceremony uh, for outstanding soldiers. That should read, Halevi said, at an award ceremony for outstanding soldiers. So the soldiers, by and large, large from what it appears here, are choosing the side of protecting the country, even though there have been threats that many would walk off due to the current situation and potential judicial reforms over there. So what is going on? Is it just a test? Is there something more urgent? Perhaps something with Iran, uh, Russia? Who knows? But certainly a situation to keep an eye on for sure. And please remember, the word of God is written in 1 Peter chapter 4, verse 7, which says, But the end of all things is at hand. Therefore, be serious and watchful in your prayers. Be serious. Be watchful in your prayers, my friends. This is the end times. Press into Jesus and know no fear. This is Jim signing off. Until the next time, God bless you.